We struggle to succeed in life and lost motivation not because we don't know how to improve our lives, but because we procrastinate. You know exactly that you need to do right now. The problem is that you can bring yourself to do it. We never have this problem when we're doing fun things. It's strange, but we don't have problems with motivation when we're playing games or traveling. When you go on weekend or vacation trip, you can prepare for all the activities, book the hotels and research the places you like to see. You have no problem finding the restaurant where you would like to eat. Unlikely Twitter or Instagram distracts you from gaming. Sure, you can post some pictures from trip, but I wonder if you will find yourself doom scrolling for an hour instead of walking on hiking trail. Hard things are boring to do. Programming is relatively boring. It is hard to learn new things and I am getting way more dopamine from traveling or playing video games. Also, I would not like to say I like running or exercise, but I know it is good for me in long term and I like the feeling at the end of the run or workout. The challenging part is to start. It is hard to go outside and hit the ground running, but that is easy to say I will do it tomorrow. So, I do that tomorrow. I plan my run in advance. I put my running clothes next to the bed the night before the run. Or even more, I am going to sleep in running shorts. Then when I wake up in the morning, I have nothing much to do. I drink glass of water and go out for the run. Sometimes I really don't like to do that. But it is dumb to change clothes when I am prepared for run already. So I go out and I agree with myself that I should at least run around the block. And of course, I end up running at least a few kilometers because what is the point to come back after running one block only? So far it works well and I am tricking myself into the running even on days when I don't want to do that. And I never regret being out for the run or exercising after the workout. After the first when you are on the track for successful and productive day. And the same applies to programming tasks and learning new things. It is easy to delegate things for tomorrow's me. Tomorrow I will have time and energy to do whatever is needed. Those are lies everyone tells themselves. But that can be true if we set ourselves to success. Set up yourself for the win. On the evening, clean the physical and digital desks for the work. I will say that digital preparation is the most important one. Close all the apps opened and tabs in the browser. Do you have 10 YouTube videos opened in the tabs? That's fine, just save those in the watch later playlist and watch them later when you will have time for that. Do you have some posts to read or stack overflow questions to answer? What else not? In open at tabs for those you have place in your to-do list. If you do not need iPhone for your work, so maybe move that to the another room. Basically, prepare yourself for productive and undisrupted work day. So, when you will open your laptop on the morning, you have to have only your to-do list for today in front of you. If you can make this to-do list uncluttered, and if you have just few, I will say three most important tasks in your to-do list, so that's amazing if you can do that. And then, yeah, <laughs> do nothing but work on those tasks. Will that make this work more fun or more interesting or less boring or less hard? No, definitely no, definitely not. But your goal is not to make those boring tasks more interesting. Your goal is to do the best to do not switch on more interesting things, which usually is procrastination. So it is completely okay if you still don't want to work on the task. That's fine. The task probably is still very boring and very hard. Okay. Maybe set Pomodoro timer for 25 minutes or whatever works for you and sit on front of your computer ready for work, ready for the task. If that is programming task, okay, open your programming ID, open the project that you are working on or open the tutorial which you were following and sit in front of your computer and do nothing. If you still don't want to do that task, okay, don't do that but do nothing else. Just sit in front of computer and be bored. Then take five minute break for coffee, come back and keep doing nothing. You know that task is important. You wrote it down in your to-do list. You just need a little help to do not fall into the dopamine and procrastination trap and do some environment conditioning to set up yourself for success. So stay bored or do the work that you planned to do. If you will not allow yourself to pick up a phone or open YouTube, you will find that it is way more interesting to work on your task that you planned to do than just sitting in front of computer and be bored.
and keep in mind that living with limited options and distractions will lead you to more successful life and definitely will help you to avoid procrastination. So keep going.